Okay, let's go. We are ready. Let's get started. What's up, guys? Lightbringer, one raging nerd, Stephen Cole, Connor Sherman, Mike Wong, John. What's up, guys? Welcome back. Happy Thursday. BG2, what's up? Happy Sunspot Day. Happy Diamond Open Day. I hope you guys are excited for today. We're going to have some hype stream, hopefully. The Malorian, what's up? Welcome back. Let's go. Okay, so we have 20 minutes for the Sunspot offers. We're going to take him to the moon, right? We're going to take him to the moon. At least, at least that's what I want. But if you guys want to test him out at low level, maybe you can try that. But I would strongly recommend to, to take him to the to the moon. Michael Greenberg, Ralph, what's up guys? Welcome back. Happy Thursday. Happy Sunspot Day. Happy Diamond Payout Day. Let's go. Okay, so let's see. What are we doing? Raids already launched. Great. Man, I'm struggling with these bio nodes. They have been very difficult. But I think I found a way to make them a lot easier. We might have the chance of testing that out today. Unlock method money. Money, money, money. That's what Scobly likes. So the unlock method, we don't have data mines yet about it. We might have it tomorrow on Friday. But it's too early to tell. Maybe in uh, two hours we'll have some information. Now, in terms of the Facebook post, uh, are you guys excited for level 100? I know I'm not. Okay, so with the fake fake book. Yeah, the fake book. So with the fake book post, uh, we have um, this nonsense over here. So Sunspot is going to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven days. Solo event. Seven days solo event. I, I I'd want to say that this is going to be a arena event, but I'm not sure. It's pure speculation, but it's very likely that it's going to be a arena event. Especially because they lowered the amount of shards you need to unlock. So it would make a, a friendly, friendly event. I got one diamond on Dazzle right in time for her to be replaced by Sunspot. Oh, yikes. How far are you on the milestone event? Which milestone? The Cyclops event? I'm, I'm doing very little for the Cyclops event. So I just need a few raid attacks and I spend a little bit of energy just because I need the... Um, I needed like bio gear or something. But that's it. I'm not spending energy on this event and I'm not going to try to complete it. Tony Sweet, appreciate your videos. Even uh, we may disagree sometimes. Thank you, man. Thank you. It, it's uh, it's important to disagree because sometimes when you disagree, you, you talk with each other, you compliment each other, and then you get a, a better future. <laughs> we'll see. But thank you for the support. Let's make it rain. Thank you so much. So yeah, the, the Sunspot event, I think it's going to be a arena event. We are not sure, but it's very likely that it's going to be a arena event. We just had a Blitz event. So we had a Blitz event over here. We had a Blitz event here. Now we have the Quicksilver event. This is going to be an energy event. And uh, and then this, it's very, very likely that it's going to be an um, arena event. Also, this the, the Quicksilver event also has a Cosmic Crucible component. So, or, or Alliance Wars, or Arena event. I strongly believe it's an Arena event. It could be a War event. It could be, but I think it's it's uh, Arena. Avil LA, what's up? Welcome back. This week, 3-0 in CC, and I finally made it to top 100. Awesome, man. Awesome. What's your name in game? A lot of people on this stream are getting to top 100. That that makes me excited, man. That makes me excited. Makes that uh, tells me that the community is pushing stronger on uh, on Cosmic Crucible. Okay, so beyond that, uh, Alliance event, 
Allied Engines. I don't know what this is, but how many days it is? One, two, three, four, four days event. Four days event. So, oof. Is this going to be a, a Cosmic Crucible event? Or Alliance Wars event? It might be Alliance Wars. And then you have Quick Rumble. Okay, Quick Rumble does not matter. And then we have the Blast Off 200. Solo event a symbiote of the Spaceways. So does this mean that we are going to get a Symbiote Silver Surfer very soon? If this is event for the Symbiote Silver Surfer, that means that he has to be released on this week of the Sunspot uh, event, right? Sunspot event, but you get the, the Silver Surfer uh, at the same time. So maybe you can double up with Power Quarters. And then uh, into the Gwenom verse right after. That's very strange. This calendar is looking way off. This calendar is looking very strange. It's going to be mostly empty. So we have a full week just for the Quicksilver event with nothing going on. Then we have the Sunspot event. And this is this is already to February. This is very strange. Very, very strange. Alliance event, Tribunal Tech. So you can expect to be forced to use your Sinister Six on offense. Machines of War. I wonder if you're going to get some of the X-Men reworks that I promise during this Quicksilver event. Okay. Onur, what's up? What happens during the level cap increase events? Training materials. I don't know, man. It's a possibility. We could get the new challenges. Oh, you are also going to get a tower. Okay, that makes sense. But it's not here. Where is the tower? Cybersecurity. Where is the the tower? Tech wizardry. Systems online. We were supposed to get the the new tower mod, the escape from kiln. On, on this week of the Quicksilver event. But it's nothing here. This calendar looks a little bit incomplete. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe it's supposed to be... Sunspot is a solo event and the Captain America is the Alliance event. Happened in the middle of the Sunspot event. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, hopefully they will overlap a little bit. VNM, what's up VNM? Welcome back. How are you doing today? Happy Sunspot day. Happy Diamond Payout Day. But I'm excited for the, the Symbiote kids. To see if they are going to gonna have some value or not. Okay, let's see. What can we do in the meantime? Let's see. Check out Arena. Okay, we are, we're doing fine in Arena. I'm going to do one attack. But uh, but we are doing fine, at least for now. Carlos Duarte Burns, what's up, guys? Welcome back. Happy Sunspot Day. Good luck with the, with the Red Stars for everyone. Good luck with the Diamonds as well. Smokey, what's up? Welcome back. Happy New Year. Thank you, man. Thank you. Welcome back. Okay, Nightcrawler on, uh, on Arena. Six yellow, six red. Who is this whale? These crazy whales over here. Okay, I'm going to apply this rub to Apocalypse, I guess. I didn't even notice this guy had, uh, had Nightcrawler. Okay, Nightcrawler with a stun on Hard Light. That's annoying for sure. And now we can uh, turn wind. Uh, ooh, my Apocalypse is... What happened to my Apocalypse? Okay, let's also turn wind his Apocalypse. Now they're going to push down my Apocalypse. Okay. That's fine. He's going to get the traumas now. Ooh, this team is powerful. Wow, look at that. I got demolished. And Dogbert was saying that Nightcrawler is not Arena meta. He's definitely Arena meta. I got absolutely shredded. Okay, so his Super Scroll is going to go first... 
Let's see if my team can survive a little bit. My Apocalypse is dead already, pretty much. And his Apocalypse will go first anyway. Wow. Wow, Nightcrawler, not trash. Sorry, Dogbird, but you're wrong. Wow. I got absolutely shredded. Absolutely shredded. Six yellow, six red. Nightcrawler in arena. Didn't they show us already the kits? They show us the kits, but they said the the kits were not uh, ready. The kits were not ready. What that means is that the kits were not good enough, and people saw right away that they were not good enough. VNM rushing on Kestrel to three diamond, Robbie race to three diamonds, and Val to prepare for Dark Dimension Seven like LVP. Uh, to prepare like LVP, like. I don't know, man. I, I would wait a little bit. We don't know for sure if you can use Kestrel in... A... Kestrel is on a situation right now. We don't know if you can use her on Cosmic and Mystica... Cosmic and Mythical at the same time or not. Thanos for Cosmic. Yeah, yeah. I, I, yeah, maybe it's time to start thinking about it. Even that Dark Dimension 7 is still like... Minimum three months away. So maybe on April we'll have some information about it, but uh, but yeah. Yeah, I don't know. You guys just saw. I got... It's not that I lost. I got demolished. So there is a big difference there, right? It's not that I lost. I got absolutely demolished. So that's, that's a huge difference. Now, what we maybe can do is use Hela instead. Because Hela counters the Green Goblin and she also counters the, the Nightcrawler. Are you going to try to top 100? Oh no, I don't have money for that, no. I, I will be happy with top 500. Top 500, like uh, Dark Dimension 6, I got top 300 and something. Which is fine. So that's what I'm expecting for Dark Dimension 7. I just can't compete with, uh, with uh, the whales. They just spend too much. And it makes a huge difference. Don't you think... Uh, don't think you can sense the nodes are non-mythic? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, yeah. I'm, I don't remember. I don't remember. That's it, yeah. It might be the case, John. It might be the case. How long was it between Dark Dimension 5 and Dark Dimension 6? It's usually one year, but uh, from Dark Dimension 5 we had Apocalypse, and then Apocalypse we had Dark Dimension 6. But when, between Dark Dimension 4 and 5 it was one year. It's usually when they get the, the level cap increase, and then the new gear tier. Quantum, welcome back. Stephen Cole, welcome back. Is the Quicksilver event only campaign energy? The Quicksilver event is Campaign Energy, Cosmic Crucible Attacks with Superior 6, and Incursion Energy. So that's all you need for this Quicksilver event. Incursion Energy, this one... Oh, Joe Biden, man. Scare me. Go away. Damn. Here I was so focused on what I was saying, and, and Joe Biden scares the shit out of me. Okay, once again. Quicksilver event. Normal Campaign Energy, the yellow one. Incursion Energy, the red one. And this is for the, the Web Milestone. That is part of that milestone. And then you have to do Cosmic Crucible Attacks with Superior 6. They need to be at 4 yellow and above, I think. Something like that. The Malorian level 100 means Gear Tier 19. No, no, no. We are going to get level 100 first, and then we are going to get the gear tier 19. If they make it at the same time, they did this on level 75 and level 80. They dropped the levels and the gear, uh, gear tier at the same time. They don't make as much money. It's better for them to make more money. First give you the level cap increase and then give the, the new gear tier. So you can expect the gear tier 19 in like March or something. 
One Racing Night the Deuce see I lost uh, by 10 points on this 40 million punch up. A bad RNG on two rooms. Oh man, that's terrible. Really terrible. There is still a chance that we'll face each other, right? I think there is still a chance. Uncle Dynamite, welcome back. Happy Sunspot Day. What is the cap on the incursion energy? No idea, no idea. We still don't have the, the limits. We might get it tomorrow on the vlog, but from the data mines, we, there is no limit on that. Based on the previous event, it might be like 5,000. I remember on the previous event it was 5,000. So I'm just gonna stock it up like to, to 3,000 and then we'll see. Wait here, why they put Osmium on so many characters? Because they want you to, to buy it. They want to make money. Yeah, if you smash that like button, it would be amazing because it uh, helps YouTube to share the stream with uh, other people, even people that don't play Marvel Strike Force. So make sure you smash that like button. <laughs> LT Gonzalez, what's up? I can't pass 6.2 incursion campaign. 6.2 incursion campaign. Oh, yeah, I remember that a lot of people are struggling with this node. This one, right? So, I don't know, like, my characters are just too big for this. So, 7 red, mystic, and tech. I think I use uh, the, the, the ones you see on the screen. It was Spider Weaver, Morgan of Fay, Kang, Kestrel, and Armamo. You can also use Hela and... Uh, and the Eternals, maybe even Quicksilver, to try to stop the enemies. You don't want to use characters that gain speed up easily, right? You don't want to do that, otherwise uh, the, the enemy Kang will go crazy. So if you take Eternals, the Kang will go crazy. So try to avoid the characters that uh, get that extra speed. VNM, I ended up taking Nova to 7 red. I think that's good. 7 red Nova... Sounds like a good idea. At some point, oh, for sure. One team for Dark Dimension 7 Legendary Battlefield. If yes, yeah, absolutely. I agree. I agree 100%. Uncle Dynam Dynamite, it was such a low cap last time. Yes, yes. We'll see, we'll see. <laughs> we'll, so the, 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 this event is divided in three parts. And I think the whales, including yourself, no offense, I think we're going to get an advantage because you need to use superior six at seven yellow stars. So if you're using them at seven yellow stars, you're going to have huge advantage over everyone else. So I think the whales will not have to spend a lot to get uh, diamonds on Quicksilver. It's just for the normies, for the, the peasants. They are the ones that will struggle with, uh, with the energy. One raging nerd, there is a, a big room up in water, if you got a minute. Okay, let's see what time it is. Let's see if we have... Uh, we have three minutes left. Joe Biden. Bro, Joe Biden, you need to calm down. You are scaring me, you are just showing up out of the nothing. It's not cool. Ricardo, come here too. Show, show the baby. <laughs> what? That's not a baby. That's an anaconda. Onur, my Black Panther solo won the node. Oh, really? That's interesting. So Onur is saying that on that node you can use Black Panther. JL Oliveira, what's up? Sunspot to the moon, yes. Okay, let's see. What? The French Legion, yikes. We have Armory, let's see. Ooh, new Avengers with here, the Ricardo. <laughs> Ernie Milk is putting the Ricardo now. Nick Fury with uh, Heroes for Hire. This is not a, a big problem. Okay, we'll take a look at this a little bit later, One Raging Nerd. I know you want to, to rush war, but uh, let's focus on, uh, on uh, Sunspot. 
and then we'll come back to water. Carlos Duarte, I'm saving my dark promos for Super Scroll. A free to play can't get other. Yes, yeah. If you are free to play, just focus on Apocalypse and uh, and Super Scroll, and then maybe you can put a little bit more on someone else, because we'll have a long gap between uh, Super Scroll and uh, and Mephisto, right? Like it's gonna be a long time. Uncle Dynamite, the points from Sinister Six will be capped. And it will come down to the, the guys with the 200, wow, <laughs> 250,000 energy saved. Are you guys doing this? Like, I, I cannot imagine how the whales play at, at such a high level. Like, for me, saving 20,000 energy, it, it, it's already hard. So I can't imagine. Serginius, what's up? Welcome back. Link, welcome back. You should use Sunspot and not Fortune Raids. Oh, that's a good point. Okay, so... Using... So, there is a situation where you need to use... Uh, where you need to use... Um, there is a situation where you need to use Forge. On all one, against uh, Dormammu... Forge gives safeguard, and it's nice to have Forge for that reason. Joe Biden is telling you that... Oh, I didn't see the list yet. I didn't see the list yet. I, I saw the obvious one, that Bill Clinton is there, but I mean... <laughs> tell me something I don't know, Captain Obvious, right? Okay, so I, I we can try that. We can try to use Sunspot without Forge. But guys, like Forge is very good. Maybe not in raids. Maybe in raids, Forge is a little bit questionable. But in Cosmic Crucible and, and Alliance Wars, like he's very good. Ve and, and he's very good in Blitz as well. Last night I was doing Blitz teams. I have a, a new, massive uh, amount of new Blitz teams, and uh, and Forge is going to be one of them. So yeah, this one right here. So Forge, Kitty Pride, and Sunspot, and Forge on his own. He was able to beat uh, Cersei and uh, Forge versus Cersei, Forge won, and Forge versus Captain Carter and uh, US Agent, and he also won. So it, it this shows that the guy has huge solo value, which is good. Streaming lagging, I don't see it lagging on my part. Okay, it's time. It's time to get a Sunspot a Cosmic Crucible rewards. Let's go. What? 7,500. What? Two thousand twenty one rating. Screenshot. Two thousand twenty one rating. This is Masters Three. Why did I got rewards from Masters Two? League promotion. Masters Three. Why did I got rewards from Masters Two? That's bullshit. So I get to Master C and I get rewards from, from last week. 3 and 0. Oh man, that this is bullshit. This is really bullshit. Master 3, 7500. As far as I know, Master 3 is... Uh, yeah, right there. 8,000. Why did I got 7,500? That, that's bullshit, man. Oh my god. That's bullshit. And the rankings are wrong again. Always good. So let's see. Okay, I think we're going to have some very exciting Crucible Week uh, on Monday. Yeah, so, yeah, the, the Forge value is very good. And uses the Infinity Energy, which is used also by... by Mr. Negative, but I would prioritize Forge over Mr. Negative. Okay, so it's time. It's time, right? So we're going to reset the game. We're going to take a look at the offers. 
We're gonna unlock a sunspot. Hopefully, he's available. Maybe we'll have Erna Milky opening the orbs. Let's see. Ricardo Santos, boa noite. Happy Sunspot Day. You get the rewards for what you started the week in. Yeah, I mean, uh, I'm not sure about that. It, it's, it, it might be true what you are saying, but it's like, it's dumb. <laughs> if it, Sunspot not on the Elite Orbs. Warning, guys. Warning. Sunspot not on the Elite Orbs. Be careful. Okay, so let's see. Let's take a look at the offers, if they are available. Okay, so there we go. We have the Sunspot 100 shards offer. And we have the 45 shards offer. I think I'm going to get the, the bigger one. Just to make sure that we can reach like 5 yell on him. Rub the belly for good luck. Oh, that, that's a good one. Nikolai, what's up? Welcome back. What I so wait for Sunspot or for a Forge? Ahmad, you get rewards from the highest rank player that... Oh, really? Oh, that's terrible. There are two rest star orbs. One with Dark Romans and the other with a new character. Oh man, what's going on? Okay, let's see. So we have the offers in game. That's good, right? What's up with these red starters? Okay, so we have the diamonds. Wow, okay. So yeah. They definitely messed it up with something. And it seems like he's not on the elite orbs. So don't open, guys. Don't open because if you open, you're going to get uh, shafted. Wolverine, welcome back. Uh, Kirill, welcome back uh, on Sunspot. So I'm going to use Sunspot as a striker. I think using him as a striker is important because you, you need to charge him up as fast as possible. The more you charge him up, the stronger he gets and the more energy is going to give on the on the next nodes of alliance of um, raids makes sense so once again striker on sunspot so he charges up faster and uh, and that allows you to get more energy every time you start the new nodes open and complain so i don't have anything to open <laughs> I literally have no nothing to open. I can open my sevens, but I'm gonna get them credited back, right? Let's see. Silver Samurai. I'm gonna open 10 sevens. So maybe they'll give me 10, uh, 10 sevens again. Cable. Yellow Jacket. Forge. I, I have all my characters at seven red. Even the minions, I think they're all now at seven red as well. You already opened 15 orbs to get compensation. Okay, let's see if uh, he's on the diamonds. Maybe he's on the diamonds. Three diamond. So Sunspot is on the diamonds, but he's not on the orbs. That, that's hilarious. Okay, let's open the diamonds then. And the Milky, do you want to get the, the diamonds? Yes, okay. So Erna Milky is going to open the, the diamonds. Sir Naughty, welcome back. Probably not uh, a store reset. Okay, yeah, that's a good point. Okay, guys, so buy everything in the store that you need just in case they reset the store. That's a good point. A big shout out to Sir Naughty. Always paying attention to the, the details. Buy everything, guys. Buy everything you need. Take gear, no. Vibranium, yes. Let's buy this as well. Rush, guys, rush. Buy everything you need. We need the basic for uh, this guy, yes. I should mark this. Can we mark it? No, we can't. Okay, none of these, none of these. War credits. Ooh, Osmium, yes, please. And, uh, okay, we're going to save just for the Osmium. And now we can get this as well. Let's go. We want to make sure that we can max out uh, Sunspot today. And here, Diamonds... 
Asian Venom, Absorbing Man, Beast, Juggernaut, Gamora. I'm still waiting for Photon. I saw that today Dorky Dad was trashing on Photon, but I think she's still good. I still think she deserves diamonds. Especially in Alliance Wars, but uh, definitely also in Cosmic Crucible. If you, especially if you are using my new position for the team. Okay, we are good to go. You want to do Ernie Milky? They are telling to, to touch the belly for luck. I'm gonna touch your belly, give you energy. <laughs> Here we go. We Instead of rubbing the orb, we are rubbing the belly. Okay, you can press. Here we go, first orb. Oh, green. Oh, green is not good. Okay, that's fine. Okay, second one. Here we go. Green again. Oh, it's it, it's not lucky. You like smoking? Oh, no, no, no. That's, that's not good. Okay, last orb. Here we go. Ah, oh, triple green. Oh, my God. Terrible. No, I don't hate it. It's fine. It's fine because when you open this, you get... Uh, like credit, you get store credit. So it's not a big deal. Okay, there we go. Core for Sunspot or Skip. I will tell you in a second. Let's test out the character first and then uh, we'll think about it. Screenshot and complain to the support. I've got five reds on Sunspot with uh, the basic orb. Awesome, man. That, that's amazing. Silver Samurai in one of the previous Dark Dimension runs. Silver Samurai is great. If you are using Lady Death Strike, Silver Samurai is great and is very cheap. Very, very cheap. Three greens as well. Yeah, I think the orb, the orb is rigged. I think it's because of the... The Sunspot bug. I, I, I think Sunspot is bugging everything. Two diamonds on Thanos instead of two diamonds on Kestrel. Oh, there you go. Yikes. Thanos, uh, you are a big fan of Thanos, so there you go. You can enjoy him now. Bigger than before. It's just your world, what's up? He's on the, he's, yeah, he's not on the elite orbs, yes. He's on the basic orbs and diamond orbs. Rub the belly with, <laughs> with more enthusiasm. Should I take Castle or Icarus to two diamonds? Castle first. I think Castle is more important than uh, Icarus at this point. Silver Hammer with the, the tier one sub. Thank you very much. Welcome to the stream. Thanks for the support. Let's make it rain. Ricardo dancing. Let's go. This is what we work for. <laughs> Thanks for the support, guys. Brian, what's up, Brian? Welcome back. Beleza. T yeah, th this tier greens is a scam. Got 40 shards on Sunspot and 180 from the... Oh, man. Kirill, that's great. You are getting very lucky. You got uh, some blessed orbs. Fred Fairy, welcome back. Diamond on Nemesis and on Forge. Oh, yeah, that's very good. You got lucky, one Raging Nerd. Okay, so let's see. Let's get the character. We can't get to the red stars, but at least we're going to get to the, the character, right? Not yet, not yet. We are waiting because it's not working properly now. We are waiting them to, to fix the thing. In the meantime, let's see if we have some data mines. We have data mines. Big data mines. Okay. Let's read these data mines together. Okay, gallery. We're gonna steal all these pictures. We are still waiting for that uh, envoy promotion. <laughs> that will never happen. Okay, there we go. Data mines, where are you at? Yes. She's inside. Okay, here we go. Let's switch around. So this was today, 10 p.m. It might be the same thing. Alliance chat, achieve ability, okay. So this is when you upgrade your T4s. Son Sonic Judgment, okay. 
Solar Mechanics. This event... Uh, so this should be for the... Um, okay, we'll, we'll have to read this in detail. More Sonic Judgment nonsense, okay. X Batteries. Okay, so we have most of the events for the next two weeks. Sco Super Scroll Red Stars. Super Scroll Red Stars update. Maximum Red Stars increase to 7. You can take Super Scroll and Zombie Juggernaut to promote to 7 Red Stars. Addition, Iron Man Zombie can now be promoted to 3 Diamonds. Okay, so there you go. The, the 7 Red Stars for a, for, a, for a Super Scroll have arrived. Solar Mechanics. Solar Mechanics offers, okay. And then we have uh, solar schematics. What's solar mechanics? I apologize, guys. I'm dyslexic. And then we have a gacha crate, solar schematic. Okay, there we go. So we have all the information that we need. Chris Bliss, what's up? Welcome back. Happy Sunspot Day. You are not using Lady Death Strike. So Silver Samurai on his own is fine. But the more Weapon X members you have, the better Silver Samurai gets. So that's the thing. CC is about to become awful. Level 100 and Super Scroll 7 Red Stars. Yes. Yeah, the, the whales are going to have a massive advantage for the... For the next month or the next season. Next season. Season 6 is going to be terrible because of all these benefits for the whales. Okay, so here we go. Sonic Judgment Official. Seven days, spend campaign energy, collect the Crucible Champion Orbs, and play Cosmic Crucible Battles with Superior Six. And uh, you're gonna get uh, the Red Bandana for Forge. This will allow you to get diamonds for Quicksilver. And there is also the Midnight Mayhem on the web store, where you have to spend Incursion Energy. So, if any content creator says that the data mines are wrong, I'm gonna punch them in the face. I don't care if it's Valley Flying or uh, the Mongolian show. All the data mines are correct. The data mines have been extremely correct lately. So don't give me bullshit again. Michael Gioia. Yes, yes. The red stars are bugged for Sunspot. So be careful. The store just resetted. Thank you. I'm going to Dark Dimension 6 without uh, VA. What is VA? I was dialectic. <laughs> it just disappeared. Dyslexic. Oh, oh, Val. Uh, and what's your experience without Val? Very difficult. Yeah, I can imagine without Val, it might be quite problematic. Okay, so three diamonds on Quicksilver. Solar schematics. Seven day event. From Isolate Camp. Wow, really? What? Gain progress towards the 7 days event from isolate campaign nodes and extreme battle in wars and molten rewards including sunspot wow that's wow this is terrible we never had a character we never had a character that was required isolate campaign energy as the main wow this is terrible really really terrible Okay, so if you want to unlock Sunspot, we have to spend Isolate Energy and play in Alliance Wars. This is absolutely terrible. So you have to be very careful. If you are saving energy, you want to balance out the energy you spend with Isolate uh, Energy you spend daily. Because Isolate Energy, it's much, it's much harder to stock up than normal campaign energy. And you can also get the three diamonds for... Uh, for Sunspot. Earn Blitz credits. So you also have to Blitz. People were saying that the events were getting easier. The, the events are getting more complicated. Mobile Gamer, I think I, I think it was Mobile Gamer who said the events are getting easier. No, the events are not getting easier at all. Alliance Wars, Isolate and Blitz 
for the same character? That's kind of crazy. Okay, so Super Scroll to 7 red stars. It's official. And that's it. So, there we go. All the data mines that we need to know for the, the next two weeks. Okay, so let's get the dude. Let's get the dude. $100. No thanks. I, I wish I could afford this, but no. I'm going to get the... The 51. Even... Do, does this... Let me see what's my situation on this. So I have 18. I'm very far away from the next one. 10 sparklers gives... 500 points. So you get like a thousand points from these. Okay, let, let's do it. Let's do it. Sunspot now in the orbs. Okay, let's go. I messed it up. I used all my elite sevens before I realized Sunspot wasn't in them. You have to reach out to the to, to the support. It's uh, it's not your fault. So maybe we'll get some compensation. I wasted. 15 Elite Sixes and 4 Elite Sevens trying to pull Sunspot before I realized he was not there. Yeah, guys, you need to contact the support and they need to need to give us some compensation for that. He's not on the Elite Orbs. Out of Misty Gear, yes. Misty Gear is a struggle. And this is why I think we're going to get a strong Misty Gear in... A, sorry, a strong Mystic Team in the very near future. Yeah, we just had the Eyes Away to Energy event, and now we have another one. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, let's reset. Connor Sherman, welcome back. You don't, you didn't miss anything. Sunspot was not in the orbs, and now he is, hopefully. <laughs> let's see. Let's see if Sunspot is now in the orbs. A lot of people open orbs for Sunspot and he was not there. Like, this is the kind of stuff that it, it just cannot happen. It's it's really terrible. Okay, so we can do offer review at the same time, right? Okay, so let's do quick offer review while my game loads. So we had the Sunspot offers. I got the one for 50. This one, I, I still think this, this is a lot of value. Especially if you are trying to get up... A, some of those more important characters. I think I might get this for for this one uh, and uh, the Titanium Alloy to get up my Silver Samurai and to get up my Taskmaster. Beyond that, uh, $100 offer for Sunspot. You can buy it thrice, which I don't recommend. Then we have uh, Iso Weight uh, plus Dark Promos. So this is to help you Getting your Super Scroll to 7 Red Stars, which we already have data mines for these. Hammer Tech and uh, Ballistic Weave, very nice. But uh, for, for $10 it's okay, it's just these gold promos nowadays, they are worth nothing. Evermaster, thanks for the follow, welcome to the, to the stream, welcome to the chat. Okay, here we have some Ice Weight Blue level 5, 50 is meaningless because you need like almost 2000. Invaders, no. <laughs> Keep those invaders away from me. Keep those colonialists away from me. Okay, we have a Spider Slayer $20. So this might be the first uh, Superior 6 that is going to be farmable. And then we have the usual offers for energy. Make sure you pay attention to Incursion Energy. Because we are going to require Incursion Energy for an upcoming event. Okay, that's it. Those are all the offers. We might have the bonus offers now after unlocking quicks uh, the the sunspot. Let's see. Okay, there we go. So we have the additional offers. Not a lot of pictures. So unfortunately, I'm not going to get a lot of pictures. Easy seven red on sunspot. Awesome, awesome. It's only showing for some people the the orbs. Ooh, that's not good. Radian Dale, what's up? Welcome to the channel. Welcome to the chat. I hope you're doing well. Happy Sunspot Day. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for the feedback. 
Someone in my alliance just got a seven red star sunspot. I restarted and I still don't have. That's terrible, right? So it means that depending on which which server you are on, you you still don't have any in the orbs. Okay, it's working now. Okay, let's see. It seems like he is in the orbs for some people, but not for everyone. So maybe it's depending on the time zone. Maybe it's depending on the Apple Store versus Android or something. I don't see him in the orb. Okay, so can you guys? If you guys are a iPhone, let me know if you're able to pull the red stars. Reset again. I just got the orbs, but not everyone does. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, let's see. Here we go. Sunspot. Let's unlock this dude. Smash. Enemy, you want to open the red stars? Okay, so let's unlock him first. I, I, I don't know how to speak some Hungarian. Okay, so this is the guy that we need to get red stars on. Wait, no. Sunspot. Yes. Okay, so we're gonna open all the elite. We're gonna open the elite fours and uh, the elite sixes so we can save the sevens for later, okay? <laughs> she is shy. She doesn't like to show her face. Okay, here we go, Sunspot. Uh, we're gonna try to pull him at uh, five or six. And then we'll save the Elite Sevens for Diamonds. Okay, here we go, another one. Let's go ahead and Milky. Bring in the luck. Oof, not, not today. Today, no luck. Okay, one more. Here we go. Purple. Oh, Psylocke. No, no, no. Almost. Okay. No. We are pulling X-Men, just not Sunspot. Okay, you can go now. Elite Five, here we go. It's gold. Let's go. Ah, oh, it's Sif. Okay. Next one. Okay, last chance to get for uh, for free. Oh, seven red stars, uh, Korg. Okay, it's not some spot, but that's fine. Okay, these now now these ones you can uh, open as many as you want until the guy shows up. Oh, there we go. <laughs> that's that's it. We got the guy. He got the the spot. Yeah, yeah. It's 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 the maximum. Yes, thank you. Thank you, Erna Milky. Be you can open, but uh, it's like meaningless. <laughs> now you can open if you need. It's always going to open the same. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's go. We got the spot. It's just not sunny. Upgrade to Graviton. Oh, yikes. Malolian is correct. There was a second star reset. Oh, yikes. No, no, you pull the, the good one. J Forenzo, I'll be unlocking some spot later after the work. Good luck, man. Good luck with the rest stars. Okay, so one regenerated even on iPhone, it's working. Okay, awesome. So it's just uh, it's just some weird RNG. Air the milk, she saw her face one time. There was one time that uh, she showed her face, one live stream. Yeah, she 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 doesn't want to be on camera because now she feels like she's a whale. And I'm telling her, she's not a whale. She's just pregnant and she's still very beautiful. Beautiful eyes. Beautiful eyes, beautiful smile, beautiful hair. So there, there is nothing wrong with being pregnant. Don't stop. <laughs> Don't stop. Oh, there you go. Okay, Sunspot is here. The solar battery. Let's go. Awesome. And the creator orb. Okay, cool. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> Little Lazy, what's up? Welcome back. Ornate Fairy. I have seen her before. She is beautiful. Probably more so. Now, pregnancy glow. You see, Ornith Fairy giving you good, <laughs> giving you good compliments.
Astrock, what's up? Two accounts of mine at Sunspot and the turn one didn't add after three years. Oh, yeah, it's very strange. It seems like they have different servers depending on where you are or something. Oh, Ernie Milk is, is saying that if we had a boy, the name would be Eric. There you go. <laughs> Random factoid from Ernie Milky. Okay, let's go. Let's get this guy going. Maxim, what's up? Send me some gear tier 18. If only, if only. We have, so in uh, Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes, you can... Uh, oh man, how am I going to go get these 5,000 or something? Hmm? She doesn't want, she doesn't want. She doesn't want gamer kids. Okay, let's see. What I wait for uh, for uh, Sunspot. I'm going to use him as a striker. I think having him as a striker is important. But it depends on how much you are going to invest on him, right? Okay, so there we go. We have uh, three stars on him. Well harder. And uh, yeah, I think this guy is going to be important. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> you saw that? Crazy Ahmad. Okay. Let's put Sunspot already on the team. Let's go. I'm going to put Sunspot uh, in the middle. Because he's the one that uh, can die. Oh man, they look so bad. Why are you always looking to, the, to that side? It's so strange. Okay, so Sunspot there. Let's put him also on the Blitz team. We have a Blitz team ready for him. This one right here. Let's go. It looks so weird. Why the characters are looking to the side? This is something that they need to change. Serginius, does Milky eat more than you now? Thank you, thank you. Thank you very much. No, she, she eats just a little. She eats a lot, but not... Uh, not more than me. Or, uh, it's different. She eats salads, I eat uh, meat, so it's different. Okay, so I think he's going to be a good striker because you want to charge him up as fast as possible. You can use him as a raider or you can use him as a skirmisher. So, yeah. We, we have to test him out. He has, he has additional focus from Cyclops. He has offense up. Offense up also gives 50% more focus. So he has a few things going on for him. But he's going to be like Kate Bishop. There will be certain situations where he's definitely going to fail to apply the, the negative effects. The, the T4s, I have infographic done, but I, I forgot to make a video about it. Infographics, where are you at? YouTube channel, MSF uh, channel, infographics. Oh, I still didn't... Um, I have it made, but I don't have the, the picture. Okay. We'll take a look in a second. Alexandrin, welcome back. Sunspot can change between Striker and Raider. Yeah, I agree. He can also be a skirmisher because he's getting crit chance from other characters. Freaking ass energy. Oh my God. Guess it makes sense for uh, this character. My girlfriend was eating the same as me when she was... Of Nazareth, welcome back. Yeah, so... It, you, you, when women are pregnant... They only have to eat 25% more than they were eating before. So when people say, oh, now they have to eat for double. No, they just have to eat 25% more. Uh, so yeah, you have to be careful with it. You have to be careful with it. But Edna Milky, she's very weight conscious. So she, she's trying to be careful about it. Okay, let me see if I can save the, this infographic so we can open. Take a look at uh, the decisions I made to give recommendations. MSF assets. Okay. 
Why didn't I save this? So strange. Or I, oh, I saved it on the wrong. Um, save it on the wrong folder. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Seven point six. Extreme X Men. <laughs> Extreme X. X-Men. Did you guys saw the new Cyclops? We have a new Cyclops coming to the game. I know usually people don't like these alternative versions from Cyclops, but I think this one is going to be cool, right? So if you guys didn't check out, it was on the Twitter for Marvel Strike Force. We have a Gorlock. Gorlock Cyclops coming to the games very soon. Very soon, Gorlock Cyclops coming to the game. I'm very excited about it. It's definitely one of my favorite versions from the, the multiverse uh, of Marvel. <laughs> the Extreme X Men. <laughs> Gorlock the Destroyer. His optic blasts pierce through your, uh, your ego. Okay, let's see what is this. Should I add a 10x button for the red stars? Yeah, we need something like that at some point. Seems I have lot lost in the comments. I can't seem to find anywhere. That's recent. We we had a, a recent blitz code. I can give you the, the blitz code right there. That's the blitz code we used last week, but now I have some new teams which we'll be taking a look at uh, whenever we have a new Blitz event. 25% is a lot. Yeah, but 25% is not double, right? <laughs> Extreme XXL man. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. That's the Cyclops fused with a blob. Is Apocalypse Dark Diamonds available? In no, not yet, not yet. The diamonds for uh, Apocalypse are not available to, to peasants yet. Okay, this is the extreme infographic. So what e force did I put on this guy? So basic, if you're using him as a striker. Basic, very important if you're using him as a striker. Then the passive and the ultimate. But this is mostly in raids, mostly in raids. So, yeah. For some people, you can definitely skip uh, some of those T4s. We'll, we'll talk about that when you start getting up the character. And I think this is the character that needs the least red stars. Because for Forge, Cyclops and Gambit, all of them have passive attacks. And Sunspot does not have passive attacks. So from all the Extreme X-Men, is the one that requires the least amount of red stars. In my opinion. How do I use... Oh, man, I, I cannot explain you now. It, we, we are doing something else today. Tomorrow, tomorrow we'll, we'll take a look at the blog post and so on. And, and we can talk about the Blitz teams. Smash that like button, yes. Ernie Milk is saying to smash the like button to help out the stream. Share the stream with other people. Okay, so... Do you guys want to take Sunspot to, to what? Level 95? Or do you guys want to see him at... Uh, at a smaller size. My, I'm going to max him out. So it all depends on if you guys want to max him out as well. Or, uh, or you want to see him uh, at a low level. That's the most handsome Scott Summers you have ever seen. Yeah, I think so. S Blob and the Cyclops had a fusion like DBZ. Yeah, I agree. They did the fusion dance. I look it up. Okay, awesome, man. Awesome. Thank you. To the moon, level 80, 95 gear to 17. Uh, we, cannot, we cannot do 96 yet. Okay, so level 80. I think level 80 is going to be too weak. I'm not sure. So, what's the gear tier um, 15? Gear tier 15 is level 80, right? 
Okay, let's see. Give me a second. Okay, level 80. Gear tier 15. Pau. <laughs> That's a close girl. It's not a girl. It's not a girl. It's a man. Okay, so let's put the eyes away on this guy. We're gonna take him to the moon. We're gonna take him to eyes away to level five proper, properly, proper, proper. What? I forgot how to say this word. Probably. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was stuck there for a moment. I, I think it's time to go sleep. She ate so much, she got fortified. <laughs> oh my god. Gorlock the Destroyer got uh, fortified in, in real life. Okay, Sunspot looking good. Like I said, I'm going to use him as a striker. Because my goal is to max him out. And we, you have to take him to Isoate uh, level 4, guys. You need to take him to Isoate level 4. Because of the, the new raids. So I might take you to level 5 as well. That's going to be pretty weak. 3 rest stars, gear tier 16. Yeah, so we're just going to try at, uh, at low level, right? Because if we take a look at the Pegasus, the Pegasus team is still holding very well with gear tier 15. Oh man, it's not enough to get him to... 60. I'm still missing a lot. So, how am I going to get more ISO 8? Yeah, I, I cannot get him to, to ISO 8 5 today. So, the question is you can see my Pegasus team. The Pegasus team, four characters at level 80, it works fine. The, the Bifrost team, the same thing. Characters at low gear tier, and they work fine. So what I'm wondering is if the other X-Men characters can carry this one. Because if they can carry, you could probably save some gear for sure. Especially because you, you're gonna require that astral energy for the new for the new silver surfer, right? It's very likely that the new sil silver surfer will use astral energy. And uh, and because of that uh, you might not have enough for him. Okay, there we go. I saw it to level 4, so he's ready for the raids. We have to do the abilities now. Okay. Blob level 100, gear 19. Yikes. I went ahead and threw him on CC defense. I think that's a good idea. T4s on the Bifrost. I can show you my T4s on the Bifrost. But uh, if you did, I, I have a video which is called like uh, Bifrost uh, on a budget. Bifrost on a budget. If you if you look for a MSF on a budget, you're gonna find a bunch of videos of mine with the minimal investments for these teams. But okay, so Sylvie, I did Alti Force. I think you can skip her basic. I don't I don't remember. This guy is all. I think I have Alti Force. Okay, this guy does not have the basic. And the Teen Loki does not have the special. The best way is to go to my Discord and look for the, the infographic. So, Discord. <laughs> Gurlock the Destroyer. You go to the Discord. You go to this down part, Arty Club. You go down here. Search for the team you are looking for. By Frost. And there you go. And there is also a video if you want to watch the video instead. 
The green T force is for raids, the orange T force is for all game modes. Okay. Let's see the T force on this guy. So here we go. The basic. If you're gonna make him a striker, of course strike the the if you're making him a striker, the T4 on the basic is gonna be important. But he's not uh, defying the character, right? So attack all the same targets and does bleed. So if you do the T4, you are going to do more bleed damage. I'm going to do the T4 on the basic. I think it's decent. It's not amazing, but it's decent. Okay, now we have the special. Apply ability block, apply slow. Let's go. What does the T4 bring to this guy? I think it's just damage. This is definitely one you can skip. I think I remember that. So, in raids, prolongs or everywhere. I think it's... Prolongs all negative effects from 1 to 2. To a maximum of 3. I think this one you can skip. He cannot extend stun. He cannot extend the ability blocker. So, I don't think it matter. matter. Rudy, what's up? Welcome back. Aida92, what's up, guys? I thought uh, Alien Spores... I think Alien Spores is going to be for the other symbiotes and for uh, the Red Goblin. The... Um, the, Gwe the Gwenom, Gwenpool with the Venom symbiote, might be Oz Formula because she's a synthetic symbiote. And, uh, and the... the the Silver Surfer symbiote might be Astral Energy. Store reset three times. Oh, man. I just got one reset. Okay, so apply offense down, apply defense down. Ability energy, okay. In raids, additional ability energy for self and X-Men allies. So this one you should do for raids. But if you still want to use your uh, Apocalypse with Archangel, this one you can skip uh, for now and just use in Cosmic Crucible. Okay, I'm going to do the, the ultimate. And now we have the passive. The passive, I think it's almost must have. So on spawn for every charge. On spawn for every charge, this character generates one ability energy for self and each X-Men ally. On spawn in raids, applies offense down for two turns. So, yeah. This one is, is only for raids, but it's very important for raids. So, I would say do the ultimate and the passive. Ultimate and passive. And skip the basic and the special. Especially if you are not going to use him as a striker. Okay, let's go. Time to test. We're going to test him out, if you can. And then we'll see if we need to increase the, the level of him. Let's join the raids. So we have... Oh, we have all the way open to the mutants. Big shout out to the Reaper to clear for clearing everything all the way to the mutants. Okay, so we're going to select Extreme x Mana. And I'm going to use that guy in the middle. I'm going to put him in the corner just because he's at a low level. Just use a sunspot in raids. He made it so much better. Awesome. Glad to hear that. So, before we start, the reason why... You can invest less on Sunspot, even if you are going to use him in Cosmic Crucible. Even if you are going to use him in Alliance Wars, it's because you only need him to be alive for one turn, so he gives energy to other characters. After he gives that energy, he doesn't matter as much. He still does a good damage, but uh, the most important thing is for him to, to speed up the ultimate of... Uh, of Gambit and the ultimate of uh, Cyclops. That's the main purpose of this guy in other game modes. And this is why you can ship out a little bit of on his gear. 
Okay, here we go. We're gonna use Gear Tier 15 Sunspot in raids. Let's see if it works properly. Let's see how much easier the raids are gonna become with him. We're gonna try to do all the nodes with him at very low gear. Okay, so this one with the Vades offense up. We are going to stun. Who should we stun? I think we have to stun Quicksilver, right? I think that's going to be the, the main priority. So you can see that Sunspot right away is top of the enemies from getting those pesky towns. And now I'm going to stun Val, I think. I cannot... Okay, uh, target Val. And he's going to give energy to everyone. So here we go. Okay, that's nice. Cyclops has his ultimate ready, but he only has nine charges. So, should we use these charges? I'm not sure. We have defense up for two turns. We can get some barrier, I guess. Let's get some barrier and focus on that Quicksilver. Wow, the damage from Cyclops is a lot better now. And Gamut is going to do his ultimate soon as well. Ability block on Quicksilver. Okay, and now Forge, we need to get that safeguard. We're also going to use the Striker as a weight. Okay, so... the Wow, the damage is insane, guys. Like, the damage is really insane. Wow, wow, wow. So we have Safeguard, so we are protected from Dormammu. It doesn't matter. It just doesn't matter. Wow, that's crazy. So the damage is so high with the Sunspot that is just shredding everyone. Okay, so I strongly believe that we can spam the ultimates if we have the Sunspot as a striker. Okay, let's see. Now, Nightcrawler with uh, his ultimate. I'm going to save that. I'm going to just do the basic to apply ability block to Captain Sam. Oh, he resisted the ability block. Yikes. I need someone to, with vulnerability to stay alive. So let's delete... Uh, let's use the basic here. So Striker is away to one charge, more charges. Let's go, nice. Gambit uh, is deleting everyone with his pings. Let's ability block the Firestarter. Cyclops with his ultimate now. He has 30 charges. Okay, we can do that. Okay, go away. <laughs> okay, so Sunspot has four charges. That means four energy. So we can use the special of uh, Forge. Very nice. Captain Sam goes again. We have to delete that Val. I'm not paying attention to that Val, but she's going to hurt me for sure. Okay, basic with Nightcrawler. Okay, nice. Let's try to apply vulnerability on this guy. And now Sunspot with another basic. So he gets more charges and that's gonna give more energy for everyone. Okay, so far a uh, small Sunspot is fine. And he should keep the charges from one node to the next. So that was definitely interesting. So you don't have to overinvest on him. Utanak, what's up? Welcome back. Happy Sunspot Day. Okay, so what do you guys think? For, sun, for a very small Sunspot, I think he, he did a lot better, right? Yeah, os Xing funcionam bem. Kaiser Tiago. Forge just standing around. Forge is very good. The more I play with Forge, the better he gets. As soon as Forge takes two turns, his passive becomes very strong. Not to anyone one time offer for $100. No, I got the $50. $50 offer. The $100, I don't know. I, I saw it was 170 shards plus two orbs. I think that was the case. 
170 shards plus two orbs. Rescue Ladder, what's up? Welcome back. Sun <laughs> Squad. It's the arena alarm. It's the arena alarm. Okay, let's see how we are doing in arena. Rank 4. Okay, let's see. No, we, we are going to do one more raid attack and then we should have enough time to to do the thing. Okay, second node. Now it's the time to see if Sunspot is going to do anything or not. You can see that we are full energy. So that's great. Here we go. Let's see if he's able to provide the energy that we need or not. For this energy, you need to do the T4 on, on Sunspot's passive. Okay, so he gave a bunch of energy for sure. And he's keeping his charges. So if he's keeping his charges, that means we can use the ultimate of uh, Nightcrawler. That's great. Okay, so they are trying to get the taunt, but they can't get the taunt. Oh, Sunspot got destroyed. <laughs> I hope he doesn't lose the charges, right? That would be so lame if he loses the charges when he dies. Okay, let's not attack that Spider Weaver. Oh, he, oh, he's back. He's back and with the charges. Oh, I love that. Okay, let's ability block Weaver. I don't think it matters, right? I don't think it matters because you can just... Uh, we can just ultimate back to back with, uh, with Cyclops. That's so stupid. Okay, let's keep uh, charging up the Sunspot. So he has six charges. Man, I really want to use the basic, but let's use a special. We failed to ability block the the Red Hulk. Oh, Red Hulk doesn't want to go away. <laughs> okay, here we go. Big Cyclops ultimate. We're going to focus on uh, Kang, just in case. Here we go. Big damage, please. Okay, 2.7 million. 2.7 million, not bad. Isolate attack and passive attacks as well. And we have the ultimate... What? We just used the ultimate of Nightcrawler. What happened? What happened? Why does Nightcrawler have full energy again? Oh, because we revived it. Okay. So that's great. If your sunspot is very small, you can revive him over and over again. And every time he revives, he's going to give full energy to... To four... <laughs> This has to be a mistake. No, no way. It's a mistake. It's a mistake. It's not... So, do you guys understand? If he dies, if he dies and you revive him, he's going to give full energy for everyone. That means you can spam the ultimate of... Uh, you can spam the ultimate of, of Forge. Oh, you see? Almost full energy again. No, bro. No, that has to be a mistake. But it's too good. It's too good like this. Okay, let's use the special here. Ooh, what? What was that damage from Cyclops? Oh, what is that? That's so crazy. Kevin Little, what's up? On spawn and revive resets the energy. Yeah, that's crazy. That's really crazy. That's very good. I don't understand why the envoys show some pictures that this team was trash. If you have a, a very small sunspot, it's actually better for you, right? <laughs> a final so incredible is wow. This is a gear tier. This is a gear tier 15 sunspot, guys. Gear tier 15 sunspot. Level 80, level 80. Okay, can we do the whole, can we do the boss? Is a baby sunspot good enough? You can see gear tier 15 level 80. Is it good enough? Now I want to put him in the middle. Now I just want Sunspot to die. Sorry bro, nothing against you, but now I want you to die. Okay, here we go. So we're gonna spam the cooldowns, and then we're gonna pray that Sunspot dies. Cyclops Ultimate did 4.6 million. Oh yeah, I, I, I was just paying attention to the left side. Okay, so everyone has offense down. Nightcrawler now with offense up, that means he has more focus. But still the, the Teen Loki's with that uh, nonsense. Okay, so now we're going to use the Sunspot ultimate. Because he's going to apply defense down to everyone. And that's going to... 
to make Cyclops look even better. Oh, we only got uh, defense down on a few characters. We only got offense down on a few characters. Okay, so I cannot use this now. I'm going to use the special first. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> special and ultimate back to back. Okay, bro, no. Okay, just use the basic there. Come on, I need Cyclops to go. Then Force can go. Man, Gambit is just destroying everyone. Okay, here we go. Big ultimate from Gambit with offense up. Wow, that was some big damage. Even without the defense down. And now Cyclops. You're going to focus on that battery build to apply the defense down to him. There you go. Massive damage to everyone. Excellent. And now we need uh, to revive Sunspot. Okay, we're going to use uh, the special of Nightcrawler to give speed bar for everyone. Hopefully we'll go before... Uh, the other guy shows up. Gamut with his special to give speed up for everyone. Come on, Force, let's go. Cyclops now with a barrier. Yes, please. He's not giving barrier to Nightcrawler. Is Cyclops racist? I think Cyclops is racist. He doesn't like blue people. Okay, we have the safeguard. The Sunspot is back. Because Sunspot is back, we can use the ultimate two times in a row with the Nightcrawler. Extend that safeguard for two turns. <laughs> Sunspot died again. Oh my god, this is hilarious. This is so hilarious. This is so hilarious. So Cyclops is going to get off. And we can revive him again. This is so stupid, guys. This is so stupid. It's actually unbelievable. This is actually beyond dumb. I, I don't know what to say. What are the envoys doing? Like the envoys, they had this on test server, and they and they what? Ultimate again with Gambit. Ultimate again with Gambit. Ultimate again with Cyclops. We did two. We did two ultimates back to back. Morgan Lafay is dead, and now we revive Sunspot again and full energy on everyone. This is beyond hilarious. This is beyond hilarious. Keep your Sunspot slow low level and just let him to die that's beyond hilarious unbelievable okay let's do the basic for reasons unknown i i don't know what to say this is beyond hilarious this is beyond hilarious what guys i don't know what to say like we saw the videos from the envoys the envoys were struggling to use this team what is this did I do Arena? Oh, I forgot about Arena. Yeah, this actually looks like fun. Every time that Sunspot dies, you, you kind of celebrate, right? You really want just Sunspot to die as often as possible. It's hilarious. Yeah, you should be able to see him, right? Because you're going to revive them every time. <coughs> this reminds me of Night Sisters in Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. In the day when uh, you kept uh, the one super small and destroyed everyone. Yeah, it, it's it's crazy. It's really crazy. What's up with the rewards? What What's going on here? You might be able to... <laughs> I, I think you're going to be able to see those nodes easily. They always wanted the darkest one to die first. Oh, yikes. I didn't want it to get there, but uh, but yeah. So, you guys saw that uh, strange interaction? Cyclops gave barrier to everyone except Nightcrawler, so... I'm not sure what that's supposed to mean, but, uh, but yeah. So, that was super fun. That was super fun. That's very different from what the envoys show to us. And it shows us, one, once again, that we cannot trust the, the envoys footage. Okay, I don't know what you guys think. That was, for me, that was hilarious. If you don't have Forge, who should I use instead for raids? Uh, if you don't have Forge, you should use uh, Archangel to turn you on the enemies. But do you have Sunspot Leatherface or, uh, or what's the situation? 
I like I like when there are good news like this. It reminds me of the first time using the ultimate of Mysterio 2.0. Yeah, yeah, this is absolutely insane. Four Cyclops Gambit Nightcrawler to the moon. Sunspot as low as possible. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's the play. Like Forge is very good, guys. Forge is very, very good. Forge is really, really good. Let, let's let's use the, the Blitz team. So this is the Blitz team for uh, these new X-Men characters. Let's see, this one is too weak. Uh, this, one, this one might be too strong. Uh, because you are facing Kestrel and they are much faster. Okay, let's go against these Hero Guardians. So Hero Guardians versus this team. And you'll see that uh, Forge, it just keeps the team alive all the time. Like, it, it's just absolutely ridiculous. I'm going to put on auto to simulate what happens when you when you sim. So Sunspot already gave energy for uh, for Kriti Pride. And now Forge with his ultimate is going to give buffs for everyone. And look look at the counter attacks and the passive of Forge. He's just destroying. He's just destroying over and over again. Okay, so now Sunspot is going to attack everyone, give energy for everyone. So yeah, this is going to be a very powerful Blitz team. You see, with Kitty Pride, Kitty Pride is trash. <laughs> Kitty Pride is absolutely trash. But together with uh, with Forge, she's actually not that bad. It's crazy. So yeah, this is the one of the new Blitz teams. I made like uh, twenty new Blitz teams or so. I will share with you when we have a new Blitz event. Okay, looking very good. Just unlock the Sunspot. So if you don't have uh, Forge, I would uh, recommend to. To take still Archangel. I still I still think Archangel is the best one because he turn winds the enemies by 25%. Okay, now we can do this campaign as well. And uh, all we have to do is to uh, is to use uh, Sunspot, right? Okay, here we go. Let's do the campaign. So what do you guys feel? Kind kind of cool, right? It definitely broke all the expectations. Once again, we want to use uh, Sunspot in the middle. And uh, and yeah, I, I'm not sure what's going on with Cyclops. It's very strange that he's not giving barrier to, to Nightcrawler. Chris Bliss, now the team really needs Force to make this. Yes, yes. 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 Uh, Forge is definitely a character that uh, I would strongly recommend to invest in. I would say that Forge, in a way, Forge together with X-Men characters is better than Kestrel. Because not only attacks outside of his turn, but he also heals and gives barrier outside of his turn. So Forge is one of those characters that uh, right away it doesn't look as good. But then when we see all the intricacy of his passive, he becomes very valuable. Okay. Oh, this is great. I'm going to get enough Isolate Blue to get Sunspot to... To Isolate Blue 5. We get a few more nodes to farm. Savage Lands. They keep talking about Savage Lands. I really hope we get a Savage Lands team soon. With Sauron and... Uh, Kazar. Burns definitely solo us. Sold us the solution. Yeah. Okay, Leatherface. If you do the raid nodes, let me know if Archangel with Sunspot worked fine for you. Or uh, or uh, if it was not the case. Maybe it's a bug and they will nerf it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, guys. I don't know what to say. We, we saw the Envoy footage. The Envoy footage was terrible. So I, I don't know what to say. The, the only thing I know is that we cannot trust the envoys. Every time we have an envoy video, when it comes to the live server, it's completely different. I, I don't think... Uh, yeah, John, like, if you have a lot of power cores, you could core for Sunspot. He's only 45 shards unlock. And you can complete uh, this. So if you core for him, you're also going to get these additional rewards. So if you have some, like, 10,000 power cores, maybe you should consider coring for Sunspot. 
Careful with the ice away to... Uh, yeah, that's true, that's true. I'm not watching any... Yeah, yeah, it, it, it's just, it's what I'm saying, like, we see we see the envoys doing something, and it, it looks very dramatic, it looks very whatever, and then when it comes to the live server, it's so different, like, are they playing it wrong on purpose, just to make drama, or uh, or what's the goal? Are they trying, like, to unders undersell the teams? Sometimes I, I feel like they are making it look bad on purpose, for absolutely no reason. The team is insane, look, Cyclops doing ultimate turn 1, this is a game changer. Now even Cyclops is good in Blitz, because he does the ultimate so fast. In the Envoy video they did... Uh, did they revive Sunspot at some point? I don't know, I don't know, I don't remember precisely. But this was something that uh, that we saw right away when we read the, the Sunspot kit. We saw it right away that if you revive the character multiple times, if he keeps the charges, like you can just exploit the situation. It's crazy. Okay, Mr. Sinister. Oh man, I want Marauder's rework and Savage Land team. Can we get that, please? Fabrezi, what's up? Welcome back. Or they build... Yeah, maybe it was the, the problem. They build him too high. And then it... it uh, and then you cannot maximize the value of... Uh, of of that exploit, right? It's definitely an exploit. People say I overuse that word. I don't think it's overused when... Uh, when you are... <laughs> definitely exploiting... The... The energy mechanics. Oh, I, I I love it. Look how many buffs they have. And this works in all game modes. It's so crazy. Okay, Mr. Sinister will be unstoppable. That's hilarious because the this team kind of sucks. Okay, there we go. And this time we had a bunch of barrier. Who gave all that barrier? Cyclops only gives barrier in raids, so that's a little bit unusual. Envoys do things backwards. They test for whales, not for everyday players. Yeah, I, I think uh, I think they should test for everyday players. But but then it comes down to the position. You guys remember when they tested the invaders? They tested the invaders. They were timing out on the nodes. It was so terrible. And then and then when they come to the live server, oh wait, they were using the characters on the wrong position, so they could not get the the, the energy right. This is the, the type of things that really I find uh, baffling, right? Baffling is the correct word. It's something that should be obvious and people cannot do it on the test server. Okay. Uh, I saw it will level 5 on this guy or not. I'm actually not sure now. <laughs> He's so good already. He's so good already. I still have to farm Blaster Eyes Await anyway. But yeah, wow, Sunspot, man. That's really eye-opening. Okay, let's reset. It's not an exploit, it works as intended. It says he gives energy on spawner. Yeah, 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 that's true, that's true. That's a mechanic. That's a mechanic that uh, that we know for sure. It's like... Uh, it's like with uh, with Psylocke, right? Whenever Psylocke dies, she spawns with more evades, more counters for everyone. You had that question, oh, should I... You had reasons to leave Magneto low and uh, Psylocke low. So whenever you revive them, Magneto gets all the speed bar and Psylocke gives all those buffs as well. What's the best position for uh, Apocalypse and the Horseman? I like to use... Um, Red Hulk, Rogue, Apocalypse, Morgan Le Fay, and Archangel. So once again, Red Hulk, Rogue. So Red Hulk makes Rogue to go faster. Then Apocalypse. Then Morgan Le Fay. So Morgan Le Fay is protected from... Uh, with the Taunt. And then uh, Archangel in the corner because he's the one that... Uh, is the squishiest. Okay, Cyclops Shards. 
isolated. <coughs> and supposedly we have more story resets. Let's see. Let's buy everything from the store. Yes, please. Miasma, yes. Buy your stuff. Yes, please. I need all these things. And more. Missy gear. So it seems like we had three resets in total. I was just able to capitalize on two. So that's that's life. I'm going to buy Miasma because I strongly believe that Mephisto will require Miasma. I don't know. It's just my speculation. I think it would make sense for him to require Miasma from all the, all the items we have in game. Here we have... Uh, no, I need that bio stuff. I'm very low on bio gear. Os okay, we have all of these. That's fine. Cosmic Crucible Store. Okay, so I didn't spend any teal gear. I was expecting to spend a lot of teal gear on this guy. And now it's not the case. Now I'm confused. I don't know what to do. Oh, I know what to do. Let's get this guy to 7 red. Loki, She-Hulk. I'm still looking for a photon. She doesn't want to show up. Okay, now let's buy all of these. Are you guys more excited about Sunspot now? I'm very excited about Forge, but Sunspot is, is definitely... In raids, is definitely fun to play with. One diamond. How can we get one diamond? Let's see. Let's see if we can get this one diamond. Watch them nerf it. It's too OP. I love it. I, I love this mechanic. It, yeah, yeah. It's not a new mechanic. Yes. Yeah. It, we have the same with... Um, what's her name? With Iron Heart Mic 2, right? With Iron Heart Mic 2, she also had uh, this mechanic on spawn. She gives speed bar and uh, energy. So it's similar to that. It's similar to that. The, the difference is that Sunspot can give up to 10 energy, right? That's that's the the good part about it is 10 energy, bro. Like 10 energy is insane. Okay, let's see if this is enough. Anomaly detected. Why? Gamut spamming the ultimate. Yeah, it was amazing, right? What? Oh my god, unbelievable. I was trying to get that offer with the... Uh... Oh no, it's still here, okay. He disappeared for a second. Let's see if this is enough to get that one diamond. Was it enough? Okay, it was enough. Okay, so I spent $10 for that. So 1 million gold, 610 materials, unstable clots, and this one diamond. Okay, let's see. Here we go. Can you get another diamond on Wasp? Yesterday we got three diamonds on Wasp. Now we should get... Uh, Three diamonds on Bullseye, right? I think Bullseye, I still don't have diamonds on him. So I really want to get three diamonds on Bullseye. Okay, here we go. The, flake, the fake Black Bolt. Three, two, one. Here we go. Big diamonds. No, it's just blue. Okay. <laughs> Iron Heart. Oh, my God. These diamonds are really killing me. Okay, diamonds for Iron Useless Heart. Okay, maybe in the future she's going to be good. If they would if they would give uh, Iron Heart Young Avengers tag, she would be very strong. Iron Heart with Young Avengers tag, she would be very very good. Someone check his medications, yeah. It's just because yesterday we got three diamonds on Wasp. Look at this. Look look at this wonderful addition. Is she so big or am I blind? Bullseye. Oh, there we go. Three diamonds. Wasp. Yes. I love it. It's amazing. Also two diamonds on Karnak and two diamonds on, uh, on Yondu. Love it. 
getting the, the diamonds on all the characters that matter. Rogue isn't chargeable, but uh, if she... Yeah, yeah, so that's interesting, right? Can he give energy to Rogue? He can give energy to Rogue, right? Or Extreme X-Men only? No, it's only Extreme X-Men, okay. He gives energy, but it's with a, with a special and the ultimate. So yeah, Rogue now, she's going to get a lot better. Because she can use uh, the ultimate and the special way more often. If everything together with this guy. Okay, I'm going to get up uh, this guy to the moon now. We already tested him out. He's great. So now we're going to take him to, to the moon. Here we go, gear tier 18. 65 astral energy, yikes. No, <laughs> too late. No, that was the plan. That was the plan. Okay, 1 million health, 200,000 power. And now you're going to open some more eyes away to blue for him. Please give, give me just the, the amount I need. No more, no less. Okay, almost done. We need a little bit more. I am running out of orbs, it's crazy. I might not get enough for him. Okay, all the orbs I had. No more, no less. And I'm two items away, let's see. And of course it's the ones that uh, I already did today. No, it's okay, like... I don't mind the, the right thing. I think... For you guys, I think it's fine, like, but I need this guy to be useful in Cosmic Crucible. And for him to be useful in Cosmic Crucible, I need to max him out. And I also need to do Dark Dimension 6 videos with him to see if he's a, a priority. So, yeah. For most people, I would say to keep him smaller. But, uh, but yeah, th this was the plan from the beginning. I think he's going to be good enough. If you are using Nightcrawler together with him, I think he's going to be pretty decent. Come on, give me those two eyes of white I need. One. Okay, one more, please. Nope. Okay, I have uh, eyes of white energy in the, in the milestones. Let's see. Nightcrawler, every time Nightcrawler crits... He's going to give speed barrier to one ally. So, because of that, it would make sense to, to use Nightcrawler or with Gambit or with Sunspot or with Forge. Tina Butler, welcome back. How good is Lady Death Striker? I, I'm a big fan of Lady Death Strike. I know some people don't like Lady Death Strike, I don't know why, but she does turning wind manipulation, she has dead proofs and evades that keep her alive for a very long time, she heals on turn, she has piercing damage, so she has all the qualities for a character that uh, is going to be long lasting. A character like that, piercing damage, dead proofs, evades, healing on turn. It's always a long-lasting character, so I, I don't know the... I don't understand this site on Lady That Strike. Please, one more energy. Oh my fucking god, seriously. Unbelievable. Here we go, spin power cores. Wow, finally. Man, the, these Eyes of Weight campaigns, they really have to double up the, the amount we get per day. What is the 20,000 energies for the Quicksilver event? Is saving for the event? Yes, yes. Next week, we have an event for Diamonds on Quicksilver. And that's why I have all that energy saved.
By the way, guys, if uh, you press and it lags, don't press it twice because sometimes it uh, it uh, bugs out and spends your resources without uh, creating the item, or sometimes it uh, creates the item twice. So be very careful with that. Okay, that's it. Sunspot maxed it out. One million health without buffs and 100,000 damage. Very good. And the special... Maybe one day we'll do it. I mean, I have so many T4s. I have so many T4s, why am I chipping out on T4s? So, in terms of position, I still think that he should be somewhere in the middle. The character that should be... You want to protect Forge? Characters that can die. Cyclops has no unspawn effects. So yeah, the characters that you want to die is Sunspot, Gambit, Nightcrawler. Because every time you revive them, they're gonna bring you some benefits. So those are the characters you want to keep in the middle because you don't have any character with Taunt. Okay, we are ready for the symbiotes. Now bring those symbiotes in. That was very cool. Okay, let's get those free climbs. Okay. And uh, so, uh, another point. I I'll make a video about it. We'll talk about the... Um, the sunspot unlock uh, and now you can optimize the sunspot unlock okay so i think all the the offers are now available okay do you guys want to see anything else i cannot do cosm i cannot do the um, i cannot do that dimension testing today because I'm on the legendary nodes. So maybe on Sunday we can test out Sunspot uh, in uh, in Artemision. But I have to, to finish the legend legendary nodes. The first one I can one shot. But the second one I have to do tap. And it takes too long. So I'm not going to do it now. And uh, that's it. Let's see. Free climbs, okay. Cyclops event, thanks. Okay. <laughs> yeah, to tap. You have to revive the. So I take one team with Morgan Lafay, with uh, Doctor Octopus, and with Green Goblin and Apocalypse. And then they die, and then you revive the apocalypse, and then you go again with like Red Hulk uh, and Rogue and so on. Okay, we are done with the raids. I think I should uh, just go do some videos about uh, Sunspot uh, and what you can do prepa to prepare for Sunspot. I think that's going to be important too. Just so people have, uh, have an idea on, of what to do. Okay, I can do Alliance Wars, but uh, <laughs> Alliance Wars is always so iffy. Let's see how much battery I have. No, it's just better. Okay, guys, I apologize. I'm going to end the stream early so I can make some videos about it. Because after I have to wait like two hours for the tablet to charge up and, uh, and it's just inconvenient. Okay, guys, thanks for everyone who joined. Good luck for uh, your uh, red stars and diamonds if you are still going to open them. Uh, in the near future we'll be back tomorrow for the blog post hopefully we'll have some information about the symbiotes kit and uh, and then we'll see maybe you can do some testing with sunspot uh, in alliance wars and try to decide if you're going to use him on defense or on offense because 
the, this Extreme X-Men team is definitely going to shake up the, the Cosmic Crucible meta and also the War meta. Okay, guys, thanks for joining. Have a great night and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Take care. Hey, West. Oh, my God. Hey, West. Sorry. Good night. Good night, guys. Take care. See you guys later.